Idaho is one of the fastest growing states in the U.S. With over 100 law enforcement agencies, the demand to protect and serve our growing communities requires skilled professionals dedicated to serving the public good. In this video, we spend time with Captain Scott Coliani and the Meridian Police Department to see why taking on a role in law enforcement is more than just a job. It's a career that can last a lifetime. At the Meridian Police Department, we run our own academy uh, jointly with the Nampa Police Department, and we use all our joint resources to build what I think is a great training opportunity, training programs and education for all our new hires so they are successful uh, when coming out of this academy and uh, delivering the service we've come to expect of them. 90 to 11, copy the drop. Our patrol officers, by and large, respond to calls all day long. They work four 10-hour shifts, and they respond to all the routine calls. So Amy and Rebecca, this is our Detective Rhodes and Victor Wayne. If we have detectives that are needed at a scene, they can come out and provide an, an additional uh, role in the field if they're needed. If, if a scene requires it, we can call out uh, crime scene and evidence techs, and their role is to come out to the scene to collect the evidence, to collect the DNA, to take photographs. We have community service officers, and their role is to support our patrol teams. They are civilian-led. They provide a key role in allowing our officers to take their progress calls. We have victim witness coordinators. Um, that will come out and meet with the victims and they serve as a support role for those people in our community that may not have that support system in place. They are key to our organization. We have a canine unit that does a lot of education, um, apprehension work, drug detection um, in the field and it is, it is without a doubt one of the best units we have in the state. We also have several drone pilots and I would have never thought in my career I'd see something like that. But they play a key role in our organization and being able to utilize technology to keep officers out of harm's way. We also have a very strong school resource officer program where we have officers assigned to high schools and middle schools and elementary schools and a crisis intervention team where we can provide community outreach through people that are in crisis. In our mission, we're always looking to serve our community in many ways, whether it's through enforcement, prevention, or education. Those are our three pillars, and we take that role seriously. This is the Meridian Police Department. Anyone inside the residence, make yourself known. And so we train our officers, we deploy our officers with that in mind. We spend a tremendous amount of time working with our community to solve problems, and most of the time we can solve them through education and through prevention, where we don't even have to use enforcement as a tool. And that's our goal. So we're looking for those individuals that if you truly want to serve in a job, such as law enforcement, wherever it may be, you need to have a servant heart. You have to have that passion to want to make things better and to help people. That's what we're looking for. Reach out to officers in your community that you want to serve. Do a ride along. Meet with them. Get an understanding of what they're looking for, what it takes to do the job. I would advise anybody that's interested in getting into law enforcement is to look into career and technical education uh, programs at high schools and community colleges. That would greatly improve their knowledge uh, of what this career is. To learn more about high demand careers in our state, visit Next Steps Idaho, a site where you can research careers that suit your skills and passions. And if you're an Idaho resident, check out Idaho Launch to apply for funding to support your training. This production was made possible through a grant from the Idaho Workforce Development Council with additional funding from the Friends of Idaho Public Television.